it's a two week project. A cob project, which is clay, sand, and straw. We use an urbanite foundation, which is broken concrete. Just from a job site up here. Trying to use as much <coughs> recycled material as we can. We're mixing it on tarps. Clay, sand, straw, putting it up. It's supposed to be a child structure, castle, two turrets. We used a little bit of adobe brick as our brick turrets. And a brick press that we have. And now we're into the plastering and finishing stage, which is about a 50% clay, 50% sand mix and we're putting it on by hand and finishing it with yogurt lids and uh, the project is uh, Myths and Mirrors Community Arts and uh, the Natural Building Institute of Ontario and a whole lot of community input. At Victory Park. Good experience. I learned how to build naturally and stuff. Because, you know, uh, this is like the real cost of building sustainably. And it's good that we know this. So we could uh, pass it on now because we know enough to you know, build our own stuff and teach other people about it. glad I've been introduced to it. Um, you know, it's uh, natural, it's easy, it's, it looks great. It's not all angular and, you know, concrete jungle style. It's more, uh, it's got soul. It has love. It's got, yeah. There you go, it's got love. Oh God. I'm so glad I have to go. Yes. Talk and talk. How have you liked it? I loved it. And it was one of the best experiences in my life. For sure. I'm sad it's ending. You're doing some inlay? We have the sun and the moon going, and a blue smiley face. Oh, you got those pieces of coin.